Spy's been around for a long time. There have been a number of games, but they've sort of almost reintroduced the character um, in a sort of origin story with the first Spyro game in this series. And I was asked to voice Spyro in that origin story and, and sort of taking him through what essentially is a total adventure told over three different episodes. He needs to be stopped. I have to stop him. It's up to Spyro yet again to, to save the day. And, and in the process of that, there's a lot that is revealed to him about Cinder's past, about who he is, and the essence of what it means to be a purple dragon as well. Not much time is left. Everyone must get to shelter. Gary Oldman, for instance, um, doing a voice for the, the, the game is extraordinary. Young dragon, you never cease to amaze me. You know, Ignitus is very much, he's like a, he's a father figure, but he's very much a mentor. I know what you are thinking, Spyro. Have no worry, young dragon. We'll make it. I like any time that female characters can be sort of heroic or as valuable as the male character. She's gone through this this path of sort of going to the dark side, but then redeeming herself and and becoming a heroic character. Hunter is a new character um, that is actually given the task by Ignitus to to find Spyro. This is my first time lending my voice to uh, to any video game. <sighs> I am relieved. I had feared I might be too late. My name is Hunter. And Hunter is a cheetah warrior. Um, he's someone who has uh, a lot of faith in the dragons and in Spyro and his posse of friends. And Mark Hamill, that's, that's pretty amazing. Obviously that comes with a lot of history of his own amazing voice work, particularly with the Joker. You've been told that I was the first of our kind, but I assure you, there have been many. And Wayne Brady is amazing as well. Um, wonderful comedian. No big deal, risking our lives, saving people, dodging danger, taking it to the man. <laughs> it's an occupation. So the whole thing's about me. It really shouldn't even be the legend of Spyro. It should be the legend of Sparks, Spyro's in it. I mean, in terms of gameplay, it's, it's a lot more advanced. Um, there, Cinder, she has become your friend. Don't listen to him, Spyro. Don't listen to anything he says. But initially, she was the, your great adversary. She was the villain. Um, and now she is your pal, essentially. So she plays with you, and there's actually a, um, the ability to play two-player co-op with this game, which I think is really fantastic. The fact that you can fly around in these fully 3D environments is, is pretty amazing. I love the fact that in this version, you can fly as whenever you want to. In the other ones, you could glide, but in this one, you just fly and scorch, fly and scorch. Just, just for no reason, you can fly and then you scorch. Before, you'd have to hop, hop, scorch as you get down. And he's, he's um, a little bit more mature than before, a little bit more uh, grown up. Now you've also got Cinder attached to you, so you're flying with Cinder, and at any stage you can switch between Cinder and yourself, which is fantastic. And the flying is really easy and really fun, and you can fight while you're flying, and you can also land and fight on the ground. And the environments as well are built around that to look so beautiful and, and fully developed 3D environments that are much more rich graphically. It's nice to see something that is just like a great game for families to play. It's expanded creatively, it's expanded with the technology, so all around it's, it's going to be a, a, a better, stronger game. And it's not, you know, it's not inventing the wheel, because it is that thing of, you know, it is the dark and the light and the, you know, good versus evil. But they've packaged it, they've put it together in a very interesting way. It's been fun, I mean, it, you know, in terms of how I was asked, I was just simply asked to be a part of it um, early on, and, and uh, I joined the first one and wanted to see it through, enjoyed playing the character, so. Are you ready for this? I'm scared. Just stay close to me.